The Rins of Galloway is a fantastic place to go looking for wildlife. From the seabirds at the Mull of Galloway, the black guillemots at Port Patrick and the Brent geese on Loch Ryan, there's loads to see. But one of the most fantastic things that you can see while walking the Rins of Galloway coast path are seals. <laughs> There are two types of seal found in Scotland, the grey seal and the common seal. Although it's called the common seal, it's the much the rarer of the two, with only around 40,000 of them in Scotland, whereas there are about 100,000 grey seals. You can see both of them around the Rins of Galloway, with the common seal more common in the sheltered waters of Loch Ryan, while the grey seal are more common out on the rugged waters of the west coast. I personally have seen seal near Port Patrick, near Ardwell, and on Loch Ryan. But today, I've come here to Corswell Point to look for grey seal. Knowing which type of seal you're looking at can be quite tricky, but there are several ways of telling them apart. The first is that the grey seals are much larger, with the males weighing in at up to 300 kilos. The common seals only weigh up to about 100 kilos. Size, however, can be hard to tell from a distance, especially when you've got the pups or the females, which are known as cows, which are so much smaller than the males called bulls. So often the best way to tell them apart is from the face. A grey seal has a long straight nose, which is often described as a Roman nose, and the nostrils are parallel and don't meet in the middle. The common seal has a much shorter and concave nose, um, their nostrils are V-shaped and appear to meet in the middle. Their faces are often described as being similar to dogs and they often look like they're smiling. Seals spend most of their time out at sea hunting for fish. So as you're walking along the coast path, if you keep your eye on the water, you might see a seal's head popping up for breath or just to have a look around and see what's happening. They also, however, do haul out onto rocks or beaches in order to rest and digest their food. And this is often the best time to see them. Mating season for seals begins in August. And during the mating season, the males will fight each other over the females. A successful male will mate with perhaps half a dozen females. And each female will have just one pup. For the common seal, the pups are born in June or July. And when they're born, they're brown and they can swim straight away so the mothers can take them out into the water to protect them. The grey seals, on the other hand, their pups are born in August and they're white. So they can't swim for the first few weeks. After the pups are born, the mothers will feed them on milk, which is incredibly high in fat, about 40% fat. By the time the pups are weaned, the mothers can have lost a third of their body weight, and the pups tripled in size. So what do you do if you see a seal while you're walking along the Rins of Galloway coast path? Well, firstly, keep your distance. Seals can be aggressive, and particularly if they've got pups. If you disturb them, the mothers can abandon the pups. So keep well clear. Secondly, if you've got a dog with you, make sure you keep it on a lead. Seals do not like dogs at all. Apart from that, just stay well back, take a photo if you can, and just enjoy the experience. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please do click the like button below. And make sure you subscribe to our channel for more videos about the Rins of Galloway Coast Path. Thank you for watching.